Proofreading is more than just checking your spelling and grammar. When done correctly, proofreading should give you the confidence that you've hit all the marking criteria to enable you to get the level that you want. The most important thing that you should check when proofreading your work is actually whether your actual work has answered the question. When you've used a journal or a piece of academic comment to support your points, make sure to check, do these actually answer the question? If they don't, consider linking them back to the question, rewording them so they actually do answer the question, or just scrapping them entirely. One of the most important things that you can do when proofreading your work is make sure that you actually hit the marking criteria. What I would recommend is that every time you use critical analysis, shown wider reading, or use critical evaluation, I recommend that you highlight that part and check it in your work. One of the most important things to check whilst proofreading your work is that you actually have a solid structure. For more guidance on how to make these really good, check out our skills guides. Something that you should ask yourself when proofreading your work is, have I used any key terms that the audience might not understand? If so, I'd recommend defining your work just to make it a little bit clearer. One thing that I try to focus on when I'm proofreading my work is maximising my word count. I look at every sentence and think, how can I make this as small as I possibly can do? I try to squeeze as many words as I can into that assignment because it means I've got more words for critical analysis, it means I've got more words to make points in. It also means that I can therefore give myself the highest opportunity to get the best marks. And finally, the most common use of proofreading checking your spelling, your punctuation and your grammar. However, I'd recommend not using just Grammarly or just the spell checker. Why? Because they miss things, such as errors where you've written a word that is spelled correctly but wrong in the context. For example, from or form, both very easy to miss when you're looking at your work. However, to avoid this, I'd recommend either reading the word with fresh eyes or reading it aloud, or plugging using the immersive reader feature of Word to have it read back to you by a computer. For more information on how to improve your proofreading skills, check out the marking checklist that's in the skills guide or the resource that is next to the skills guide. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day.